Hello everyone and welcome to Zublo's Kitchen. Today I'm joined with, by, with Nina. Morning. Nina here. And what are we doing today, Nina? You know what? I have a craving for potato chips and dip. Ooh, potato chips and dip. But we're going to make homemade dip. You know what? It's quick. It's easy. It's fuss free mm. because because we have a packet it's called onion onion from tastefully simple now you can't buy this stuff in stores but if you are interested please contact us at Zudlow's kitchen and we'll hook you up this tastefully simple they have Oh, their seasonings are wonderful. They have onion, onion. They Which have is what this is. Garlic, garlic. They have all uh, spices. They More than just spices. They have all kinds of stuff. But today, we're going to do onion, onion, and make our own homemade onion dip. Now, I used the Italian garlic seasoning in my uh, lunch, pizza Lunchable recipe, and that was delicious, too. So. This is, and, and. The onion, onion, and their seasoning and their spices. This we're just gonna do a dip today, but you can use this on anything. Yes. Oh, on your eggs, scrambled eggs. Mm, mm, mm. Chicken, you can chicken, steak. Season your steak with this. It is delicious. And we have a little book here, and it says that one tablespoon of this. So one tablespoon of this equals. Six tablespoons of fresh onion. So, there you go. If you don't feel like chopping up onion. And crying. You, you could use this. So. Okay, let's get started. Yeah, this dip is pretty simple. It's only two ingredients. So, let's, let's, yeah, let's get started. Okay, so we need. All right, I'm gonna. Adjust. We need. Sour cream and this little packet, and you have onion dip. Fresh onion dip. Okay, so we're using light because that's all they had at the store when I went yesterday. So, yeah. And all you do, it's one cup. One cup of sour cream and one whole packet of the onion onion seasoning. And all you do is you mix well, blend well, and then you let it chill for two hours. Now, I hear the, oh, the longer the longer you let it sit, the more the flavors come out. So, you want to make this for a party, do it in the morning. Uh, or the night before. The night, yeah, the night before, just let it sit. Probably, ooh, smell that. Oh, oh! you can smell the onion flavor. Mm -mm -mm. And you know, there's not just onion in there. I know there's a little bit of garlic and a couple other uh, ingredients. Yeah, there. so it says onion, garlic, sea salt, shallots, red bell pepper, parsley, chives, leek, leeks, and citric acid, which I think that what... Well, yeah, that's what preserves keeps it. it. Yeah, preserves it is. Okay, one cup of sour cream. Going into the bowl. Going into the bowl. And believe me, we're gonna scoop all the sour cream out of here. And if you notice, the ingredients, they're all everything you can, you know, it's not. Yeah, nothing. Weird. Yeah, not ingredients that all you ingre can't pronounce. Yeah, all ingredients that you know. Okay, Zed, all throw right. those in there. All right, the all whole right. packet. Whole packet, and let's just mix that up. It says blend well, so just mix until your heart is content. Oh my gosh, that smells delicious. Oh, it does. You know what? I wonder, I know it's a dip, but I wonder if you could like throw this, grill some chicken and like spread this over the chicken. As oh, it, yeah. You know, it, like that's an idea. It's almost done. Oh, because this is, smells like heaven. Now, now, now as now. she's mixing in, I'm going to kind of tilt the camera up. So they could see our faces. Maybe if I scoot this back. There we go. So 
So we actually do have that, we might try this, I don't know when. We do have the garlic garlic seasoning as well. I can't, I'm not even. So look at this, it's, a, it's done. Let it chill and then we will come back and we will taste this. Um, yes. There is one thing. Yes. Tastefully Simple has been around for quite, quite a, a while, while, I'm sure. And there is something here that I think is delicious. It's called Bountiful Beer Bread Mix. Oh my God, it is so good. It's a beer bread. Yes, you make it with beer. You don't have to make it with beer, but you can. It is delicious. Some, oh, it is so good. That you would have to try. Again, you'd have to contact us at Zedlow's Kitchen. Yes, and the link will be in the description below for the, the taste really simple, simple stuff. Because you can't buy this stuff in stores. But yeah, we're gonna, okay. we're not, not right now, but we're gonna try the garlic one too. I don't know, are we trying this today? Because I see we're having steak. Did you want to put this on the steak or? Oh, that would be a great idea. Oh yeah, season the steak with that. So, and then again. Oh, you know what? Maybe we can put some, um, a little bit of butter, make a little bit of garlic butter, and put it on the top of the steak. Oh, oh there that we sounds go. good. Uh, again, you can also make a dip out of this too, which this one requires mayonnaise and sour cream, both half cups. So we can actually do that when we get back to the store. We can take we out can. butter, let it get soft, and we could we could try it out. So we we'll do that. But yeah. So now we're gonna let this chill, and we'll be back in a few hours. She does clean apron. Voila. All right. All right. Oh, is that really whirling? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. Well, so that's what it looks like. Look at that. Ooh. It looks delicious. It smells it? delicious. It does smell delicious. I just want to. I got to taste it. Just mix it in. Mix it up, you know. Yeah. Get all whipped it in together. I think it kind of smells like French onion dip. Light chip, what? Well, it's onion, onion. Oh, heavenly. We use light chips. Okay, you ready? Ready. Get a good chip. Good chip. Nice thing, nice. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you broke it. A nice, <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> nice helping a dip. Let's taste. Okay. <laughs> oh. Mmm. 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 Mm. That's really good. <laughs> it's good. It tastes mm. like, um, what does it taste like to you? Better than French onion. <laughs> you okay there? <laughs> yeah, I'm What's good. What's in that bottle? <laughs> Let's taste it again. Mm. Tastes like, um, I mean, it tastes like onion. But it tastes like, like an onion bagel. Mmm. 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 You know, I cannot find onion bagels in the store anymore. So maybe I'll just buy plain bagels and put this on this. Yeah. Mmm. Is that plain cheese? Yeah. Oh no, I know. Take the bagel. Oh, maybe. Try, I'm gonna try this. Take the bagel, put butter on it, put this seasoning on it, and then kind of like toast it, like put it in a pan or stick it in the, the oven there. And like, oh, there you go. Yeah, so it bakes in. I think that'd be good. No, that's really good. Mm-hmm. Very successful. Yeah. But yes, if you want this, want to order this, the link will be in the description below. Uh, what we used was a cup of sour cream. No. What was it? What's it called? A um, not a starter. Uh, oh, sam a sample packet, oh. uh, which made this. But you could use it for anything. So. You know there, what? Yeah. 
I'm gonna stick a little bacon in here. Oh, there you go. Mm -hmm. We just made some too. <laughs> but that does it for this episode of Sub Those Kitchen. Thank you all so much for watching. I really appreciate it. We really appreciate it. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. I hope you all have a wonderful day. Remember to be the best you can be, and we'll see you all in the next video. Bye! Bye! Eat that dip.